Sai Kung is arguably the best place to go hiking and find serene nature in Hong Kong with beautiful beaches, secluded island, and yes, hikes. Now, Sai Kung is a pretty big area in northeast Hong Kong with a geological park in the north and extends all the way across the bay to the south. I want to introduce you to five of my favorite hikes in Hong Kong, both well known and hidden gems. Number one is absolutely Kam Khoi Shek Den. Kam Khoi in Chinese means toad, Shek Den means stone top, and it refers to this almost platform like formation on top of the mountain by the Highland Reservoir. The hike is relatively easy along the Maglihose Trail Stage 2 from Saiwan Pavilion and then a branch off into a smaller dirt trail. You'll get a good view of Saiwan Beach and Shark Peak on the way too. The best way to get a good shot is with a drone and you return the same way you came. But you can also end your day at Saiwan Beach where there are speedboats back to Saikung Town Center. The second is Lo Da Shack which is behind the Tai Dun Shan, a more famous mountain by Bak Tam Chong. The trails has several possible starting points, but the easiest is from Bak Tam Chong, which has parking as well. Lo Ta Shek means thunder hit rock in Chinese and refers to the rock on the side of the mountain. You can see all the way to the east dam of Highland Reservoir, to Clearwater Bay and Taipo at the top. Third up is Maglihos Trail Stage 4 which technically straddles Mount Anshan and Saigong. It is a steep climb up from Tai Shui Han on stairs, coming up just behind Mount Anshan and along one of my favorite views in Hong Kong, a panorama of Saigong. From the ridge, you can then carry on down to Mount Anshan Country Park or go up to Pyramid Hill to Ongping, which is a popular place for paragliding and camping. Fourth is a short but hidden hike, the Pok Ku Wan. The start is along the Shangyo Country Trail, taking you past the Folk Museum where you can see the way of life for villagers who lived there centuries ago. Pakuan itself is a semicircle concrete dam that was used for rearing and catching fish, but became abandoned when the villagers left. While you can climb on it and even walk all the way around, note that the structure is pretty damaged with exposed metal and concrete and swimming there is not recommended. Last but not least is the Long Ha Wan Country Trail plus the Green Egg Island. Green Egg Island is already covered in my top 5 favorite islands in Sai Kung, so the spotlight is on the Long Ha Wan Country Trail. Located inside the Clearwater Country Park is a leisurely trail that goes up Thailand Tong with a great view of Sai Kung's park shelter and the surrounding village. On the north side of the peak, there are also several big boulder clusters perfect for photos. I hope you've enjoyed this. Subscribe and watch my top 5 Saigon beaches and islands videos if you haven't already. I have all the hiking guides on my blog and I also have a detailed e-guide that includes 41 plus hikes, beaches and islands plus how to get there.